Hi, this is Dan at Master Trader, and in this video lesson, we're going to define what long put options are. In our option strategy series, we divide the strategies taught into directional and income producing. Buying puts, being long puts, is a directional bearish strategy. But what is an option? It is a contract allowing for the right to buy or sell the underlying stock during a specific time at an agreed upon price. Put buyers pay money and have the right to sell bearish. Put sellers receive that money and have the obligation to buy at the agreed upon strike price. That's bullish. We will cover that in a different lesson. So long put is a bearish strategy. So again, the definition, when you buy puts, you're paying money, which was referred to as premium, for the right, but not the obligation, to sell the stock at the agreed upon price called the strike price for a specified time referred to as the expiration date your max gain is your break even which is the strike price that you bought less what you paid for it then if the stock goes to zero that's your maximum gain your return on investment is whatever gain you got by selling the puts when you're done with the trade divided by what you paid for it. So you're profiting as the stock falls with leverage and less risk compared to shorting the underlying stock. So let's look at the option quote screen. Here's our QQQ ETF trading at 114.05. So the 114 is at the money. It's the closest one. It's actually five cents out of the money, but it's at the money. So when we buy puts, we at Master Trader recommend in the money puts because we get paid more for our directional bias. So I just picked 117 for this example. That's an in the money put. Why is it in the money? Because we are buying a contract, a put option that gives us the right to sell a $114 stock for $117. That difference is in the money. So the quote right now in this particular option has 15 days to expiration. And we obviously teach in our strategy course what is the, the proper way to determine which strike price and expiration to buy uh, consistent with your bias of the stock. But this one is quoted at 363 by 371. We always recommend trying to get filled at the midpoint. That's it. That is buying puts referred to as long puts. Hope that helped.